In addition to exporting parts of a model in the XTML editor, you can also export the entire project. Exporting the entire project allows for all project artifacts to be included, not just the modeling ones. In addition to modeling artifacts, you will also get code generation related artifacts as well as all build related artifacts and configurations. These can be viewed in the navigator view. To export an XTML project, right click on the XTML project in Model Explorer and choose the export option. In the dialog page that is open, expand the general folder and choose the archive file option. In the archive file wizard, you are presented with two trees. The left tree allows you to select the parent container, while the right tree allows you to select individual files. When exporting the XTML project, it is suggested that you simply check the project level, which will include all files required. If resources were selected before initiating the dialog, they will automatically be selected for you. The To Archive File field allows you to choose the export file. You can either enter this manually or you can use the Browse button and navigate to the export location. Then you enter a file name. Next you click Save. Once you have entered the location you have a few options to choose from for the desired export. You can export in a zip file format or the tar file format. You can also choose whether or not you'd like the contents compressed. Once you are happy with the options, you can click the finish button. Navigating to the file system location that you exported, you can now see that the archive file was exported. We can open this zip file and see that the entire project structure was included. The tool can also import exported archive files. Let's delete the GPS watch project and then import the archive file that we just created. To do so, you right click in Model Explorer and choose the Import option. Then you navigate to the General folder and the Existing Projects and Workspace option. Next you'll select the Select Archive File Radio button and choose the Browse button or manually enter the target. The Projects tree list all the projects contained in the, in the archive file. You can have multiple projects in these archive files and you can choose which ones you want to import from there. In this case we only have the GPS watch. At this point there are no other options that you need to set so you can click the finish button. You can now see that the imported project exists with all of the modeling artifacts and going to the navigator view we can see that all of the non-modeling artifacts have been imported as well.